Right, it's down here somewhere. Right, this looks pretty churchish. There it is, on my left. There we go. Church of Saint Isui Patricio. Right, let's go and have a uh, look inside. Morning. What, well, me, us three? Yeah, yeah it's gonna be great. Know everyone, dog. Hey, what's up, dog? Hey, yeah. welcome. Right. Yeah, that should be right. Yeah. Please come here. We'll take a door one with the, the church in the background as well. Well, I did, but it is, it's a lecture like that way. We'll yeah, take, let's, ta right. let's take loads. Yeah. Thank <laughs> We won't get the bike in. You're from Lancashire. I'm from Lancashire, but I live in Leominster and Hereford with my partner sometimes. Oh. We'll take them on going that way. Say cheese. You're welcome. Day. Enjoy the day. Thank you. See you, bye. That's a bit nice to do my bit, taking a photograph. Right, let's go and have a look at the church. So, uh, there's the entrance. This is It's very tiny, you don't realise how small it is. Going down there. Nice little cross there. Right, let's get in and have a look at this uh, oxblood painting. Wow, there it is. That is it. Painted in oxblood. And they're not sure if it's representing time or death. They haven't decided yet, it's one of the two, but uh, that's it. And that, the rude screen, I think it's one of the best examples of one of its time. It's very, very, very old. Check uh, Google, the rude screen at uh, Party Show Church, and that is very old. And then you've got all these other medieval wall paintings. It's incredible. So I guess people in the new world, in the new world, boys, They've got nothing like this. Their history's only very young, isn't it? Look at that. That is so intricate, that uh, carving. Okay. So this is the chancel. I know all this from Time Team, you see. Little cross. And then looking back down at the little nave. Wow. This is so cool. I don't, I'm not into what churches stand for, but the history and the architecture and the artwork is just amazing. It really does tickle my tickly bits. All right, so this is the, uh, the painting up close. It's amazing. There's his spade. So yeah, apparently this is ox blood. And when you whitewash over it, it just keeps coming back. So they've just decided to leave it exposed, which they should do anyway, in my honest opinion. But yeah, it's, it's amazing to think that was painted in early medieval times. Right, I'm very happy. Thanks for uh, mentioning this, Mark, because now I'm here and I've seen it and it's, it's awesome. Thank you. There's the, uh, the entrance to the church. Little walkway up, and there it is. There, lovely old building, early medieval. I'm not sure the exact date, so you have to do a bit of uh, Google searching. But yeah, it's lovely inside. Real nice. The old cross. What does this say? Not a great deal. It's heading down to where we came in. Skewed on the A465 and Abergavenny over that way. That's looking down the other way. Yeah, that's the 
back of the church, not a great deal there. Lovely, really glad I've uh, come to see this. Like I say, I'm not into what churches stand for, but the history around them and the architecture is just great. Right, I'm gonna have me a little drink and something to eat because I'm having a casual time. And then we're gonna head up over there and over there. <laughs> 